Senator Isaacson announcing he will retire at the end of this year. Governor Kemp will now appoint his replacement, who will have to defend the seat in 2020. Joining me right now is Chuck Todd, the moderator of Meet the Press. Mm -hmm. Johnny Isaacson is the last of his kind, Chuck, not only in the U.S. Mm -hmm. Senate, but American politics. You know, a, a common sense kind of guy who reached across right. the aisle, someone who would argue with you and then say, you know what, let's go have some cocktails. Right. And then say, how can I help you in your district? How can I help you in your state? You know, it's interesting. There's two types of elected officials, right? There's the elected official that enjoys getting involved in a group of people and coming up with a compromise solution. They're legislators, and they enjoy it. And there are some people that have to, sometimes they just want all the credit, they want to be the deciders. They're the ones that run for your governors and, your pres and for president. And Isaacson is one of those guys that, you know, that you, you hope, you know, the Senate is not filled with a bunch of people that love legislating. He's one of them that did. And now, uh, so much money will be flowing in. This is going to be a major oh, yes. battleground. Wow. Congratulations. It, it what I would say is, I, what I would say is, is that for every owner of a TV station or a digital publication in the state of Georgia, uh, congratulations. This is the decade now, a decade that Georgia will be a, a battleground state. I mean, if you look at what's happened now, two Senate seats this time, obviously the demographics are in, show that it's going to be competitive in the presidential. But the, the one of the Senate seats immediately two years later, we know the governor's race will be. The point is, Georgia, I think, is basically by the end of the de next decade, will replace Ohio as sort of one of the go to battleground states that we talk about in American politics. Yeah, wow. Hey, Chuck, thank you very much. Have a great Labor Day weekend. We look forward to seeing me. You, you too, on buddy. Sunday, as always. Thanks.